TrackMaker tutorial. A common problem that people report to us is that if they've been using the TrackMaker suite of programs with the Geonics EM31, 38 or 61 etc or the Geometrics G823 magnetometers, when they try and convert the raw field files into an XYZ file for mapping purposes that they get an error message saying no data is present. I've created a file here called no name and read in some EM61 data in this case to see if we can see what's happening. Now we can see here that we've got approximately 37,000 EM61 readings and a similar number of GPS positions. So obviously the file does contain data. Now let's go and create an XYZ file. First of all I need to give it a name and now I'm going to select proceed to create our XYZ file using the default parameters. And here you can see that I get this error message saying no readings and advising me to check the GPS or EM data settings. So why are we getting this message when clearly there is data there? Well, down the bottom left hand corner of the screen here, these four parameters are effectively a filter on the data. And I'm now going to alter one of them in turn to see if we can create our XYZ file. First of all, I'm going to increase the GPS time gap to a large number, in this case 300 seconds. The GPS time gap is effectively a smoothing filter on the data, which will fill in data points if a GPS position has been missed out for some reason, maybe you're under trees or in the shade of a building, etc. We get the same error message, so that hasn't solved our problem. So I'm going to alter that back down to default. The other thing I'll try is increasing the PDOT mask to 9. Again, we get our same error message, so this has not solved our problem. So I'll put this back down to the 4. And now this, what I'm going to check is the corrections. I'm just going to select raw GPS, hit the proceed. In this case, you can now see that the program has created an XYZ file with the GPS positions being marked with the grey dots and these are overlain by red dots, which are in this case are EM61 data. So our program has now successfully created an XYZ file. You may wish to go and fine tune the filters to see if you can improve things or accept this as is.